1951 Fender No Caster. This guitar is slightly modified. It's all original, except for one little problem. Someone decided that they didn't like the sound of the front pickup and wanted more of a Gibson hybrid. So they put a patent applied for Gibson humbucker in the front. And it looks a lot like Keith Richards' guitar. And that's why I bought it, because it looks a lot like Keith Richards' guitar. And, and it's also guilt-free, because I wasn't the one that did the route job. And it's been routed for probably over 40 years, because um, the pickup is from 1962. So tellies are great. A no-caster, why they call it a no-caster? Well, in 1950, Fender made a guitar called the Broadcaster. It looked exactly like this. And the Gretsch Drum Company also made a drum kit called the Broadcaster, only instead of a C, they had a K. Leo had all these old logos out, and for the year 1951, through most of 1951, to about October, all they did was clip the word Broadcaster off the logo and put Fender on the headstock. So it became known as the Fender No Caster. In 51, this was just a Fender guitar. This was the only guitar they offered until they made the Esquire and then ultimately the Telecaster. So here's what it is. It's kind of cool having the front pickup in the front, having a humbucker in the front, because you get it, this nice little kind of thing that's not a Gibson, but it is a Gibson. They didn't charge me for the dirt. <laughs>